To create a 3D cube in After Effects, you need six layers that represent each side of the cube. Here I have a Minecraft dirt texture, which I'm gonna drag and drop into my comp. Then we'll turn the 3D switch on and we'll switch over to one of these custom views, which allow us to see things from different 3D angles without having to create a camera. We can also hit T to bring up the opacity on the layer and lower it slightly just so we can see things a bit more clearly. Now let's duplicate our layer by either going up to edit, duplicate, or by using the control D shortcut. Set the anchor point to one of the sides you want to rotate it on, turn on snapping, or you could hold down control whenever you're adjusting the anchor point so that it snaps to any of these points. Then click W to bring up the rotation tool, hold down shift so that the rotation snaps, and then click and rotate accordingly. We can now repeat the process of duplicating our layers, adjusting their anchor points, and rotating them until we end up with a complete cube. Swapping the layers with their respective textures from the project panel, and we can do this by holding down Alt, clicking and dragging one of the textures, and dropping it on top of the layer we want to swap it with. Let's now create a new camera and a new null object, make it 3D, position it in the center of the cube, and parent all the layers to this null object. We could also turn on the shy button for all of these layers, lock them so that we don't accidentally move them around, and then enable the shy button on the composition so that the shy layers are hidden. This way we have a clean timeline, we can control the cube with a single null object, and also have the ability to orbit around with our camera.